The Great Dane is a giant but gentle dog breed that has existed for a long time. Is this planet? The breed is also known as the Apollo of dogs. And we should mention that there are Dane-like dogs found on artifacts that date back thousands of years. Today, the breed is known for being easygoing and loving family companions. And if you are wondering, what is it like to have a Great Dane in your home? Make sure to finish this video as we will talk about the pros and cons of owning a Great Dane. Hi there, welcome to the Dogverse. If you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe to our channel for your daily dose of dog-related content. As mentioned, today's topic is the Great Dane. So, let's begin. Pros 1. Easy to train. The Great Dane is ranked as the 48th smartest breed in the intelligence of dogs alongside the Boxer. According to Stanley Corrin's book, they understand new commands in 25 to 40 repetitions and obey the first command 50% of the time or better. It only becomes hard when you attempt to train full-grown Great Danes who are already set in their temperamental ways. This doesn't mean that it won't be possible, but it is going to be relatively hard. When training Great Danes who are puppies or young adults, it is best to use the reward-based training system, as almost all dog breeds react positively to this method. This helps dogs understand what is expected of them while also making the training process fun and enjoyable. 2. Family Dog Great Danes make great companions and family dogs due to their highly affectionate and playful nature. Additionally, they get along extremely well with children, especially if they've been exposed to their company right from the puppy stage. Great Danes can be territorial every once in a while, but if they're used to having kids and other pets around, they will adapt themselves accordingly. However, if the Great Dane is a full-grown adult and has never been around many people at once, let alone kids and other pets, it all depends on the nature and temperament that the dog has ingrained right from the time of birth, as some Great Danes can be extremely territorial and ferocious if they've not been trained to be family-friendly. 3. Watchdog While the AKC outline in the Great Danes breed standard that these tall dogs should never be aggressive, their sheer size is sufficient to deter unwanted visitors to the home. Great Danes are definitely an apt breed for protecting and guarding your home and family. These dogs have their gentle and affectionate qualities but can be aggressive when the need arises. Additionally, Great Danes are highly commended for their bark's loudness, which is enough to intimidate and deter any intruder. Hence, you can be sure that even the gentlest Great Dane will make a good watchdog. 4. Affectionate Great Danes are commonly referred to as gentle giants due to their highly affectionate and friendly disposition, regardless of their daunting size. These dogs may look intimidating on the outside, but love to cuddle with their owners. They're also extremely playful and don't really have unpredictable natures as some breeds do. In fact, 80% of Great Danes that underwent the American temperament test have passed, which is a very good number. This test doesn't measure the aggression or territorial nature of the breed, but rather measures how well a breed is able to interact with various humans in different situations and environments. In short, Great Danes are definitely found at the top of the list in terms of affection and playfulness, which is a definite good side of a Great Dane good and bad. 5. Grooming Fortunately, unlike many other dog breeds, Great Danes don't have to undergo regular grooming appointments cutting and brushing fur as they don't have a thick coat of fur. Instead, they possess a shiny, sleek coat that will have to be maintained with routine baths and occasional brushouts. Although their coats won't get mangled and dirty very often, they still do need to be bathed whenever required, 
as this will help maintain the healthy fur coat. Just be sure not to bathe them too often as that can dry out their skin, leading to other skin problems. Dogs can develop infections in their ears if they aren't cleaned well. Hence, make sure you clean their ears at least once a month as cleaning it too often may damage their ear canal. Cons. One, drool. This may not be very surprising, but Great Danes are huge droolers. This is mainly due to their face and jaws structural composition, which is quite square with loose lips. Due to this, they aren't very good at containing their saliva within their mouths and end up drooling all over you and your home. While there always will be a certain amount of drool about them, the highest amount of drooling occurs when they're eating, drinking, or exercising, so you may want to keep a few old rags in hand to tackle this problem. Some Great Danes can drool more than others, and there's really no preventive method you can employ for this problem. 2. Lot of exercise. Great Danes require regular exercise on an everyday basis, depending on their age. When they are in the puppy or senior dog stage, this requirement will have to be modified to suit their energy levels and health concerns. But during their young and mature adult stages, a Great Dane will definitely require at least an hour's worth of physical activity and exercise. Without this, a Great Dane can feel locked up and develop negative behavioral characteristics. Exercise can be done in the form of walking and playing other games like fetch. Additionally, if you happen to have a considerably large backyard, then you can let them loose there for a while to expend their energy through their own means. 3. Separation Anxiety Great Danes are dogs who love being social and having their family around them. If you haven't heard of separation anxiety in dogs, it's a good idea to research this chronic canine condition before you bring your dog home. When left home, especially for long periods, this can cause major anxiety in some Great Danes, which can even result in destructive behavior. The possible result is barking, howling, whining, destructive chewing or digging, and even defecating or urinating inside the home. Great Danes are big dogs and can be destructive if they wish to be. And separation anxiety is one major reason for this problem. Hence, it is advisable to never leave your Great Dane alone for long periods. 4. Destructive When it comes to Great Dane good and bad, we have to discuss whether they're destructive due to their size. Great Danes are large dogs who have higher energy levels when compared to most other breeds. Hence, they can be quite destructive if their energy is not put to use in constructive ways. This is one of the reasons why these dogs will not be a great option for owners who don't have the time or space to exercise and play with them. Additionally, some owners claim that Great Danes tend to get destructive when left alone in a house with no company. So, if you live in an extremely small apartment with no outdoor space and don't have the time to exercise a Great Dane daily, this may not be the best breed for you. You have a chance to train a Great Dane puppy well, which will eliminate most of its aggressive or destructive tendencies. 5. Health Issues Great Danes can suffer from genetic diseases, so it is best not to miss out on regular visits to the vet while also keeping an eye out for the common diseases Great Danes usually suffer from. Bloating is one of the fatal conditions Great Danes may struggle with. So it is wise to know what the early symptoms are for this disease in order to get them help before it is too late. Joint and bone diseases such as hip dysplasia and osteoarthritis are also common among Great Danes due to their large frames. Additionally, Great Danes are also prone to suffer from thyroid problems and heart diseases, such as dilated cardiomyopathy and tricuspid valve dysplasia. We reached the end of our video today, in which we talked about some pros and cons of owning a Great Dane. Anything you want to add to our lists, tell us in the comments. If you find the information in our video helpful, 
please leave a like, subscribe, and maybe share it with your family and friends. Make sure the notification button is on so you'll be notified with new videos. Hope to see you in the next video.